Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel once again, Flight Gear Erisha. So you are with Lucky here and sorry, ah yeah, you are with Lucky here and today I'm going to show you the uh, autopilot tutorial for Airbus A330. So let's get started. So this you can see this is called as MCP mode control panel and this is to change the speed on the mark and this is to select your uh, speed and this is to select your heading and I don't know what's this this is to um, switch the vertical speed and FPA I don't know what what's FPA and I didn't use it at all um, next comes is altitude so this is my altitude and you can set your desired altitude and this is vertical speed so what is vertical speed you ask um, so now you can see I've set 4000 to my altitude and I've set the vertical speed to 2000 so uh, vertical speed is how much time do you take to climb to the target altitude so that's called as vertical speed hope you understood <laughs> okay whatever this is localizer and that's used for ILS landing which I'm going to uh, tell uh, tell about it in my next video and this is also used for ILS landing approach APPR and I don't know what's this I haven't used it yet uh, okay so this is AP1 and AP2 and this is auto thrust so if you want your aircraft to maintain the uh, uh, selected speed whatever you select here uh, you have to enable the auto thrust or else the aircraft uh, or else you need to control the speed manually um, fine and this is auto autopilot 1 and autopilot 2 these both uh, act as backup for each other so that's it now let's take off let's take off okay so I'm up in the air now so I, I've reached 1000 feet so now I can enable the autopilot I want the auto thrust to maintain my uh, maintain the speed and I also want the autopilot to follow the inputs whatever I give I have given it to my aircraft whatever I've uh, given to my MCP so the aircraft tries to maintain it and one more thing beside this if you are making a if you are planning a typical cruise flight then there is also one more uh, one more way uh, now you, can, you can't always keep changing your heading to that side and this side so you have to just set the speed uh, heading to managed and you can also set the speed to managed and you can also set the altitude to managed so I don't want these altitude and altitude speed and heading to be managed right now as I am just flying uh, I'm just flying a casual flight okay okay um, sorry I'm a bit unclear um, that's it guys thanks for watching my today's video everyone and I will see you in my next video. Until then, goodbye.